We will now show you how to use Volvo Penta assisted docking in a full real life docking scenario. When we enter the marina, we turn on assisted docking. First, we locate the docking spot where we want to dock. This example will show you how to dock stern first. Now, when we know where we want to dock, we move forward by pushing the joystick forward. We know that we will move in a straight line because the system compensates for wind and current. As you can see, we hold the joystick in a steady movement and we can control the speed by how much force we apply to the joystick. Now when we are in front of the dock spot, we want to rotate the boat. We let go of the joystick to pause and let the system find its position before we do the next movement. We rotate around the position by twisting the joystick. The faster we twist, the faster the rotation. With assisted docking, you normally don't have to apply high force because of the precision and that the boat keeps its position. You can move slowly. When the stern is in position, we push the joystick backward. If we feel we need to adjust sideways, we can always release the joystick to assess the distance and then we can use the tap function to adjust slightly. We can hold the position until we have secured the moorings. When docking sideways against the dock, we get in position by turning the joystick to adjust the heading to be fully parallel with the dock. We can fine tune our alignment with a quick twist. We either tap to get in position against the dock or move in a slow continuous movement until the boat has reached the dock. We activate the side push function in the display to stay fixed against the dock while mooring or disembarking. Be careful with mooring lines and spinning propellers. Assisted docking gives any captain the confidence to maneuver a boat in crowded marinas, enabling easy boat docking in challenging conditions.